Aqualand opened in August 2010, not long after the centre opened. Um, it has been a great success. The clients really enjoy um, working here and doing activities here and it has grown since its inception back then. Keeping clients busy in our detention centres is obviously very important and activities play a huge part in that. Aqualand serves a number of roles here in, at Curtin. It's, uh, it teaches clients about aquaponics. We're also learning about horticultural um, activities. They do a number of other things like make musical instruments. So it's not only an area where they can come and reflect, but they're actually learning some skills while they're here. There's a number of different things that, that they can learn. Um, for example, I think the, the, probably the main area of, of learning is around horticulture. Uh, the concept was, it was based around the aquaponics uh, system, which is a sustainable uh, horticultural system involving both fish and plant life. Recently our clients were involved in the redevelopment and establishment of a sensory garden at the nursing home in Derby. They um, built a deck, they redeveloped the gardens, they assisted in putting up shade structures and they also built a water feature. A sensory garden helps our clients to stimulate their sense of sight, their sense of smell and their sense of hearing. Personally, I had an impression, a different imp impression of them and I was a bit apprehensive when they volunteered, but well, it was different when I saw them. And well, I appreciate the work that they are doing and now they are kind of like part of us so that when we have events, we call them in because they've given something to the community, especially us. There's also some benefit towards us, towards the community and how we can outreach into the community, include our clients in that outreach towards the, the community uh, and foster that bond between, uh, between our clients and get them start, to start them, introduce them into Australian culture. We have a number of different um, cultures here at Curtin and have done since we opened the centre um, and this is a great place for them to come and mix together and, and learn about each other's cultures and, and taste each other's food and things like that. It's a very pleasant area, it's lovely and green, it's nice and cool. There's lots of different plants, um, herbs and spices with the and the waterfalls. So in, in terms of a contrast to the outside area, it's, it's really different and it's really lovely.